Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Forza Motorsport 3. Today is episode number 189. If you want to help support the channel, then leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe, and feel free to check out the other videos in the Forza Mega series. Now let's get into the content. This episode was streamed live on YouTube. If you want to make sure to catch the streams, then be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to get cheap game keys for Xbox, PlayStation or PC, then check out Eniba in the description down below. All right, so we are here for the Class R2 Championship. Uh, I have no clue whether this is going to be three videos or four videos. Um, based on the fact that they might be almost 20 minutes each, I'm going to say four. But then that means this one's going to be four, but with a really long race. I don't know why I thought it was 10 and then 11. It's not. It's 11 and then 13. And there's 13 events. My maths is wrong. If I'm doing four videos of this, that means there's four races in one of them, three in the others. The numbers don't add up and it's going to take forever. Why did I say this was going to be the last stream? Anyways, we're starting off with Sebring, Circuit de Catalunya, Sedona Raceway, Silverstone, Suzuka Circuit, New York Circuit, Le Mans, Sunset Peninsula, Road America, Twin Ring Mategi, and then finishing off with Miguelo. Let's get going. All right, here we go. Let's get going with the first race. Oh, yeah, by the way, I'm taking the uh, Koenigsegg because this one is a sick car. I love the CCGC. I think it's a beautiful any cutting take to be fair is a beautiful car. And this thing has pretty insane cornering abilities, which is surprising for a car like this, because there's no actual aero upgrades to it. So, other than the big wing at the back of the diffuser. Tomorrow is another day.
Do, do, do. Full of compromising. Come with me to the dance floor Very good, very nice, very good, very nice. This thing is bloody brilliant. Do 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 do. Yeah, so we are looking about 20 minutes of race, which uh, throws my planning out because it means that this is going to take about four hours, just this one, and the next one's going to take about four and a half. So I'm going to be extremely pushed for time today.
Come with me to the dance floor You and me, cause that's what it's for Oh, there's a stream tomorrow night as well. F123. My team mode. Which is going to be fun. Whoa! Under steering like a bitch. I'll smack you like a bitch. Into pieces. This is my last resort. Cut my life into pieces. I reach my last resort. Suffocation, no breathing. Don't give a fuck if I cut my arm bleeding. Papa Roach is amazing. Losing my mind. Is there something wrong with my live chat? Let me refresh it quick. Chances are dynamite. Dun -dun 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 -dun. Losing my sight, losing my mind. Wish somebody would tell me I'm fine. Alright, we've got two more laps after this one. A 
little bit slower on the splits. But one thing I have been noticing is I've been getting a lot more consistent with my laps in Forza. Like, oh, he says that as he goes wide. But my consistency is pretty decent. Even there. I mean, I went wide and I still got a best lap. we go smooth like butter ah <laughs> oh, my finger slipped off Crash a little bit there. Which uh, isn't great. Ah, oh, this is a good one. If you guys are enjoying the content, feel free to drop a like. As uh, it greatly helps support the channel. Whoa, whoa, whoa. A little bit too much curb there. No, completely missed that one. Lovely. Let's try that again. That is P-Money, I think. Hey, hey, hey. Light touch my hands in a stream of golden scans from now on. What a chew. Right, let's go. It's time. And we're off.
while we wait, while we wait. What is that Porsche doing up my ass? Go away. He's right on my tail there. Okay, now the Porsche's gone. So this is where I'm in my element is straight, so. Corners, not so much. Clearly the car isn't very good at, cor especially corners like that. That felt really slow.
Ding, 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 ding. Vroom, vroom. What's happened with my music app? Why is it not functioning as a music app? Oh, it's trying to play off the ground, which doesn't... Okay, I need to delete that off the playlist then. Because if it's not working, then it needs to go. Because it stops the playlist. It's like a stop button for it. Honestly, really not a fan of how long these races are. Because I do just want to get this completed today. But it might end up being that we do R1 in a completely another live stream. Because I don't see myself doing 12 hours when I wasn't expected to do 12 hours. I was only expected to do 5 or 6.
Car behind is ten and a half seconds behind, which is good. Behind the better. Hines, welcome back. Gosh, that took a long time to connect. I'm still waiting outside in the car. I'm still tied up to the passenger seat. <laughs> oh, that funny. By the fire, son. In the morning, will come soon. Tell you stories of a better time. I love this song. Such a good song. Interesting story. <laughs> Alex, what up? How are you doing today? Hopefully you're having a good day. What up, homie? Don't hold me up now. I can't stand my own ground. I don't need your help now. Alex, don't forget to like the stream. It helps support the stream. Haha. <laughs> Just back from shopping. Shopping. Awesome. By the way, guys, if we hit a hundred views for every hundred views that we get on the live stream, uh, I will gift. A channel subscription to someone in the chat so share the stream out as that will really help support the channel and as soon as we hit a hundred views I'll gift us channel subscription channel membership I gotta get, get used to it because I got when I started twitch I've been doing YouTube for a while had to get used to that now I'm going to have to do the exact same thing, but for YouTube again. Man has liked. Man is in good books. Man is blurry. Man is not blurry. Man is sort of blurry. Man is not blurry anymore. <laughs> oh, I've lost all that time I just gained. Wow, man, he's cunt. <laughs> That's amazing. Kianta. Don't hold me up now. I can't stand my own ground. I don't need your help now. I don't even have a clue what happened there. This is the end of Forza 3. This is hopefully the end of Forza 3. Um, but I don't know if there's one more part left. Like one more stream. We're on the last legs, definitely. But this one is going to be huge. Prepare for 20 FPS. Is that it on PC? Because Crude was complaining about it, and I was like, it can't be that bad, can it? I'm playing it on PS5, so I'm hoping... Jesus Christ. Well, I'm lucky I got a PS5 code then. I got a PS5 and an Xbox Series X code, and a PC code. Oh, for fuck's sake. So I'm, I'm really confused as to why I got both. That was a bloody brilliant save there. Yeah, but the difference is that this is supposed to be a later on build, so it should be more optimised. So...
But yeah, I, I can't go into detail too much about the crew motorfest because it's under NDA. So the the sorry, the insider program portion, so before the beta is still under NDA. It's been confirmed by Ubisoft, so we can't discuss anything about what the insider program was like. Because that's still under NDA, even though the game's out now. So I'm a little bit confused why they've done that. But, um, yeah. I can't discuss what the insider program was like. I, I am hearing that the handling's pretty good, though, so... Bang, bang. Ba -da -ba -da. Hans getting ready for setting up his stream later. What are you streaming later then? By the way, this song is name is huge. Look at this. It goes all the way to the end of the screen. That's crazy. What the hell? Okay. So basically, Lidl has copied Greg's because Greg's did exactly the same thing. Don't forget chat. Share the stream out. <laughs> this is a good song. Uh, this is Dead Mouse remix of this one. I don't even understand how I manage that. Why the hell am I sliding? looks really squashed. I don't know why, but my Discord name is now A. What do you mean your Discord name is A? You changed it to that. Because Discord requested everyone to change their Discord username. Oh, come on! Yeah, you... What? Your Discord name is not A? What do you mean? Are you... What? Your Discord name hasn't changed. What do you mean? It's the one you set. It's still the same one that you set as, like, your permanent Discord name. Alex, you have small brain syndrome. I don't even want to talk to you today. You have small brain syndrome.
So you know when things normally shorten text down automatically? Either because of a scaling error or something like that? They normally put a lot of dots after it. That's what that is. It's the same as when you resize a piece of text and it doesn't fit on the page. They'll put dots after it. It's the same thing. All you need to do is just restart your Discord and it will be fine. Oh, man's has small brains in there. Oh, my Discord name's been changed. Someone's changed my Discord name. No, it hasn't. Mr. Small Brain. <laughs> Get out of the way, Nissen. Bong bong, bong bong bong. I think um, Alex is just having a small brain moment. Oh my gosh. I need to stop looking at chat too much. Th these races are too fast for me to look at chat. error thing, Mech the Cunt was right. I, Mech the Cunt is always right. What do you mean? I have a high level of intelligence. I am correct majority of the time. <laughs> and it just goes on. And it just goes on. And it just goes on. I have this thing called common sense that's uncommon. Because nobody has common sense anymore. So now common sense is classed as intelligence. Do you know, I did an IQ test. I think it was like one... Uh, I'm trying to think what it was. I don't know whether it was one... 132? I think it was 132. It was either 123... 132 or 142. I think it was 132. Because I don't think the numbers went in order. That's why I'm thinking it was 132. So. I do have a, a, a very high IQ. But. I don't use it much. If you leave with me. I'm tempted to take an IQ test now. Like, this wasn't one of those online IQ tests either. This was like a genuine professional IQ test that I took. And it was like 1, 3, 2, something like that. Pretty much. Pretty much I'm a Ferrari owner. 
My brain is a Ferrari, but I don't use it. No, but it's um, what's it called? When I when I went to college, started college, they made us do this test, right? And it was like a sort of intelligence test, but to sort of work out your ability with numbers and all sorts. It was it was a pretty good test, but I was I was like I don't know miles ahead on this test, like insanely far ahead compared to anyone else. I was supposed to, um, when it came to my maths, I got a six in maths, right, which is equivalent to a B, I believe, like a high B, um, maybe a low A, but the problem is I was sort of aiming to get a nine. Uh, I only did two of the three tests because of the fact that I had pretty much a family emergency. I wasn't in the right state of mind to do the test. But the problem was, right, if I had failed, because a pass mark is a four, technically. So if I had failed maths, I would have been given another opportunity to try and get nine. Meg, mega mind. Pretty much. But yeah, I would have I would have had another opportunity to get a nine if I had a failed math. I could have just reset it again and then actually got a good score. The problem is the fact that because I got a six, I was passed. And they wouldn't let me reset it. Even if I could have. They wouldn't let me redo it. Which annoyed me like crazy. Because my, my paperwork, my all of my years in school basically came up to what those GCSE results were. So for 16 years of my life, well, we'll say 12 years of my life in reality. For 12 years of my life, I worked my ass off in school to try and get a decent result in computer science, maths, whatnot and because of the fact that one day one singular day didn't go well it's basically changed those results for the rest it was five years ago now and it still bugs me to this day and it's gonna bug me till I die like our education system in the UK is so broken and so stupid like when I was in school I was like oh why do I don't understand why people don't want to go to school like why do why do kids not want to go to school I'm enjoying school you know now that I'm five years on from that I realize a lot of the shit in school like what school is supposed to teach us doesn't fucking teach us anything like, as a species, right, when we were cavemen, right, we, the adults would teach the kids how to live. You'd teach them everything. Why the fuck don't we do that now? Like, genuinely, it, the, the UK's education system is so fucking shit. Like, it's so bad. It's terrible. best example is the fact I know that plants breathe in carbon dioxide and breathe out oxygen due to a thing called photosynthesis but I haven't got a fucking clue how taxes work I just hope that the tax man gets it right and if the tax man doesn't get it right he gives me my money back and I hope the tax man gives me the right amount of money back you know like is this actually like planning how to spend your money and whatnot again that's not something that gets taught in schools 
like I'm only just starting to realize actually that that having like multiple bank accounts and budgeting your money and whatnot like how to do that and how to do it efficiently so that you don't get screwed over at the end of the month how to work out savings accounts and whatnot how to all this shit I've only just started doing but realistically it should be the job of said school to teach people that and we don't do that it's just such a fucked up system and it's still bug like honestly I'm bitter about that result because the fact now is like I can't say oh I was proje projected a 9 well what did you actually get I got a 6 so you got a 6 in math Fuck. Like, it irritates me so much. Shut him down, shut him down, shut him, shut him down, shut him down, shut him down. I turned the V-Sync and now I have 60 FPS. So it's V-Sync that's the issue. Why is V-Sync causing issues though? It shouldn't be. V-Sync is supposed to detect what your GPU is capable of, like the output, and then just not render any extra frames on top of that. So it's supposed to say, oh, your monitor is set to 60 FPS, right, I'm going to render 60 frames a second at this exact time. Whereas on V-Sync off, it will just render it whenever it can. So in theory, V-Sync is a lot better because it's stable. And you have consistent timings between each frame. You don't get screen terror. Like, I don't get it. I don't get it, lad. Yeah. V-Sync on. That shouldn't make an issue. So, I don't know what Ubisoft has done. But that shouldn't be causing an issue. I mean, <laughs> I know it's beta, but there's a point where beta should be working. And those kind of things should be working. Like, there's no way that you can go through basic testing and have something as big as that crop up. Yeah, they still have the window to fix it, obviously, so it's not the end of the world. But, an issue like that shouldn't get missed up, in, even before beta phase. That's why it concerns me. Like, if a beta has... A, a beta, the point of it is that if there's any server glitches, if there's any glitches with the game code, the fact that the progression may not work properly, that's what a beta is for. A beta is not for fixing every issue in a game. I mean, it, it is for fixing issues, but there are some basic issues that games have that should be fixed prior to a beta. Saving Ghost, please don't turn off your console. I will not, because I don't want to redo that race. 
Oh, lovely. That is that done. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one. Peace out.